Hey everyone and welcome back to the channel. So this week we have um, spent a lot of time actually in the evenings uh, programming up two Arduino Unos and these OLED screens. So as you can see we've got a different uh, couple of messages on each one. Um, we've put them on the gantry that is the, that's across the entrance to the port area. Um, so this is the screen showing the exit telling people to drive on various different sides of the, the well <laughs> telling everybody to drive on the left in various different languages uh, depending on who's landing in the port and who's uh, coming off ships etc uh, as you can see we've got a couple of people working on the on the gantry we've got a guy there that is actually um my minifig uh, from the profile picture and uh, the supervisor there looking after the, the work and we've got a couple of other people down below we've got Emmett there on the radio and another um worker that's that's here to service the the vms screens which is something close to uh my own day-to-day -day real job so if we pan around here to the other side um we can see the different messages on that on the entrance screen to the port um so it has a uh, basically directions where you're going to go and uh, no unauthorized entry etc and there's a there's another page i think as well Oh yeah, various variable speed limits on minifig activity, yeah. So that's pretty much what we've been doing. There's two different Arduinos running the uh, the screens. Um, if I pop this tile off here, you can see the, the plug going into this side of the screen there. And I had to shave a little bit off that with a Stanley knife just to get it to fit in there. And that's one of the reasons why um, the, the plug being on that side is one of the reasons why the cable for both screens is coming out of the right hand side of the screen and as you can see the cable here is underneath the screen and here it is running along the gantry here and um, it comes down here to this very unsightly and rather large um, bunch of connectors so the connectors are all here to connect the cable onto the Arduino going underneath the roll plate here so one of the things I'm thinking about doing is rewiring um, that plug top all the way from the Arduino and that will cut out this big bundle of connectors. Um, it's it's just a bit unsightly also. I need to change that for a black um, cable tie and hopefully that'll make it look a little bit better as well. Um, we could hide that maybe with something with some planting or something like that. Maybe, I don't know. Um, there's two, just, just to uh, fill you in, there's two Arduinos working these screens, one for each uh, screen they're not going to go to waste on just the screens what i'm going to do is i'm going to use them to light up the the port here as well with some flood lighting all along the road here and perhaps do one or two other things as well and yeah that's pretty much it that what we've got done this week not much in the realm of lego building but certainly it is a it is a great addition i think to the city it looks really well if i move this out of the way i can get past it and yeah we think it looks really really well there and as soon as you switch it on it just keeps on cycling through those messages we can put whatever we want on it um to display on it but um we think it's just it just it adds a little bit of character to the city i suppose a bit of animation so that's what we've done this week guys um and until the next time uh, i hope you enjoyed the video this week but not that there was that much lego as i said in it but uh, until the next time we'll see you later